what's up guys my name is Dimona Kenny welcome to my YouTube channel I know I look crusty but then I look crusty for a reason because I just want to create the right narrative I don't want to give you like false narratives of who I am I just want to make sure that you get the right picture about me and we grow together and uh, this is the way to fight for my this is the right so listen before I stand on business just make sure to subscribe to hit the notification bell so that every time the web 254 posts anything okay you are able to be notified so you can come and get celebrated come get educated come get um, entertained anything all of it is gonna be here on the web 254 so but we're gonna jump right into the fast story right we're gonna stand on business right away so listen Nick Cannon is bringing the wave to not the wave 254 <laughs> not me obsessed with the wave 254 to the motherland that is big news it's 2024 guys i've been saying 2024 is gonna be the year of i don't know the truth it's definitely gonna be the year of the truth i'm super excited for all of us that's just one thing i'm just like oh my god they're coming to us they're coming to africa and listen he is looking for talent too so it's there, there's gonna be a lot of things going on and also listen guys don't forget <laughs> the canon is um the king of baby fathers so we might be having like an extra baby mama from africa coming to loading somewhere tick tick tock i do not know but listen nick cannon confirmed this is not an allegedly or it's not a rumor it's confirmed and he posted on instagram and this is what he posted so first watch the video and then we're gonna you know read the instagram caption so you guys stay ready <laughs> Wild and Out is coming to Africa and Kenya is one of the countries that they have confirmed they're gonna be coming to and when they come to Kenya they're gonna be looking for Wild and Out girls so if you have watched Wild and Out you know the Wild and they're the baddies you know in every corner at the DJ booth on stage they be all over the room okay they make the room they, they make flowers they make the room look beautiful right and also if oh funny so you know that they, it's it's a comedy show it's like a, it's not even a stand-up it's not even it's like they be roasting each other you have to be quick on your feet with your comebacks and stuff so make sure that you stay tuned go to nick cannon's instagram stay tuned so if you're interested you're able to grab that opportunity i am so excited for africa it's 2024 guys it's on our second story let's get into it let's get into it let's clock the tea so mc tv host aziza was asked on an interview J Unam too, okay? This was her response. This is how she responded. This is the funniest video I've seen. This I feel like this is the best meme of the year. I don't care like what anybody else says, but her answer to this particular question, it just it got me. Nazeka, I swear. Nazeka. I'm Nioi. I'm Nioi. Unam to Jamani. Jamani Unam to. I can relate. I, you guys, you guys gotta stop playing. <laughs> Listen, Web Nation, man, you gotta stop playing. Look at that babe. That babe is so beautiful and she's single and in the street. That's me every single morning. It's like, yo, I'm, I, I'm the baddest to ever do it and I'm still single. Kwani Hamunioi! Hamunioi, that's the baddest meme. I, 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 I'm calling it. It's the baddest. It's gonna be used very very badly in kenya in, in on x and everywhere else and also if your man don't like 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 ask you pop the question and to like be real to me i got kabi mo muluze hamuni oi mwana mni toy kwenye soko jameni da do jameni ni macho kwa tuwa subiri tuwa subiri ya tuta zekea kwenye hii nini kwenye soko jameni kidogo tumekuwa vibanda kwa soko ay ni manza kukua personal 
it has become personal you guys i gotta go <laughs> on to our next story we're gonna be talking about shakila tiffany first of all somebody call tiffany shakila T why am i calling her tiffany i didn't even know she's called shakila tiffany i just knew she's called shakila right somebody call shakila and tell her she, she, she's doing her big ones you know she's making every hater that say that she was never gonna be shit she's not gonna be nothing it's their words and i love that for her she's in south africa living her best life good for her good for you girl good for you and my man my man that's all i see on her stories every single day but this is what she had to say guys she wrote on her instagram and said it's not even possible that men cheat more than women right a man needs to have money to cheat as for woman a woman only needs to be alive to cheat okay and i had to chill and be like wait a minute what wait a minute she she might have a point <laughs> she actually might have a point listen listen guys for a man to cheat you gotta have money but then in a world like this uh it's kind of crazy because what one happened to Sherati? Like, people are even cheating with broke people, guys. What one happened to Usherati? Like, loyalty is no longer a thing in our society. It really sucks. It really sucks. But then it's like, people just gonna cheat for cheating. But then at the same time, it makes sense. It's like, for a woman, you don't need no money to please no man. Like, but then you appear to generation in your wana ume wana takawa mama. It's just, it's just a different type of generation, you guys. Don't take it personal. Wave Nation, don't take it personal. I'm only playing. We are here, we are for everybody in the Wave Nation, okay? But listen, what do you think? Do you think she's right when she said that there's no way men cheat more than women, whereas men, because men need money to cheat, as opposed to us, we only need to be alive, baby. You know, just to cheat. Okay, and for money, you might, you might need money over here to, you know, to pump your woman a little bit here and there. Just putting it out there, you know, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> so tell me what you think down below in the comment. It was beautiful to have you here today on the Way to Fan Nation. This is our first episode. I'm super excited. I'm super happy. I'm super proud that I started this. And I hope as we move ahead, we get it entertained, the channel grows. And make sure to just support a girl. All I need is support and loyalty. And I promise I'm going to bring you growth and greatness on this channel every single day from my heart. That's a promise. Anyway, thank you guys. I hope that you have a, hand, a wonderful weekend. Because this is dropping on Friday. Period. Make sure that you don't drink and drive. Don't be out there drinking and driving, okay? But make sure to take care of yourself, to love yourself, to protect yourself, to work hard, to look for that shimani because we are the wave gang gang, the wave nation. And we don't cough, we don't fold, we are the bodies, period. What you doing over there? <laughs> Stop, I'm trying to clock in. Clock me in, you ain't gonna clock me in? <laughs> oh you ain't gonna clock me in? You gonna make me put it in. <laughs> Give me that bone. Stop! Give me that bone. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. What you doing? What you doing? Get it. 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 That's your ass, play too much, for real. That's a bet. Here's a bet. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, I get it, watch out, watch out. You know that's my You know. Darren, Darren, did you clock in? Yeah, I did. How about you? Nah, yeah, I was about to clock in. Yo, you know what you did, bro. You know what you did. the fuck? There go daddy, y'all. Get back there. Come on, man. Stop doing too much. Sit down. Hey, baby. Come on. Pull up. Let's go.